Oh, fuck. I have to fix chat. Hold on. I always forget. I'm sorry. It's, it's my bad. If I could just fix it once and then have it work every time, that would be great. It used to. I swear. I promise. <laughs> More like every... It is the whole year, admittedly. I've been saying that. You know I've been saying that for years. Hey, I've lost. How are you? Um, I have to pull up my um journal or whatever. I'm so fucking tired. It's not even funny. I, there's literally no reason for it. Zero. None. Um, And yet here I am. <laughs> Me to the mirror. I can't stop lying. No, I believe in you. Surely, one of these days. Um, okay. Hate being able to hear myself that much. Let's tone it down. Okay, I s started my um, art journal back up again, and it is going halfway decent. I actually drew in my sketchbook today. It looks like ass, but I drew, and that's what counts. Th there's going to be a lot of skips for me here. Um, okay. So, oh, it's more likely to happen. Like, do you just call me back? That unlikely? Um. They, well, they said we wouldn't recognize him. Um, okay, anyway, what the fuck? Okay, it's just an object. Okay, it's color. Which is unfortunate. Because that's going to take me... Depends on how strong the hurricane is. Okay. A cupcake. We got Jello. 7,000 pictures of Nishiki. Um, on Pinterest. Um. Tulpa. Okay. You lost me. What the fuck is a tulpa? Y I saved a bunch of good objects. I don't know. Some woo-woo stuff. That people can will a person to do. Dude. Manifesting? I fucking love manifesting. Um, That's not like exactly the same. But like it's a similar vibe. Um, I had a friend. Whose mom like took manifesting seriously. So fucking funny. Okay. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Ooh, I did not save a whole lot of stuff. Gummy sharks. I hate rendering glass. Fuck you. Can't be asked. I'm gonna do the peanut butter and jelly sandwich. I don't wanna listen to this play. I manifest John Lennon. Back to life only to back to hell. That bad? I wasn't I'm I wasn't into all them all that much. It was really funny because I had taken a pop culture class or whatever, right? And so there was obviously like the the British invasion unit or whatever, I guess. Um, um but I just didn't the class overall was kind of funky because his favorite activity was um, asking questions that were super vague and very opinion based. And I have I guess I had trouble with that. Probably the autism. Um, because if you asked me like content based questions, I was so there. I was like, yes, I'm super ready to go. Uh, it's in really good songs like Saving Me by Nickelback. I'm not sure. I've heard that one. And it will probably stay that way. Um, but the, um, uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. There's a British invasion unit or whatever. And I think his, his question was like, um, do you think the Beatles um have an impact even today on like american society and like i didn't 
think so, but I didn't know how to put that into words. Um, so I lied and said, yeah, sure, they have an impact. It was really funny because he came back that typically he um, agreed with me on a lot of the things that I said because I'm always right, obviously. But that one thing that I had lied about, he was like, I don't agree with you, but I see what you're saying. I was like, thank you. I don't see what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, if they want to. Yeah, pretty much. I didn't give a fuck about anything. All right. Paw print brush is so back. Okay, maybe it's not. Okay, paw print brush might be back. Um. I don't know if I want to... Probably not. I'll see if I can get the colors down. We're so back? Yeah, I did. Um... That's not, no. Um, okay, that's good. I have to start actually doing warm ups again or whatever for TikTok. I fucking hate posting. It's the worst. Only posting, like, when I'm streaming is literally a dream come true. I'm not even going to lie to you. That shit rocked. It didn't last very long that I did that, but I enjoyed myself. So like, I, I don't even get on the app. It typically, I, I, on, I am only there so people come here. This is what I give a shit about. Um, like, I'm, I just, I'm only there to market. And it is wildly unpleasant. The low tier garden. What? The who? Um. Happy for you, possibly? I don't know. Uh, catching a fade? That is so beyond me i the jokes are funny sometimes like i like um i'm gonna saturate it we ball um maybe i'll okay we may be cooking here um the wins the hows the wears um the jokes are funny i i see an occasional um solid um thing uh a solid joke on like tw on, on twitter because i don't fucking get on the app so i see the i see it on twitter instead you know like og punk music and values seeing what tiktok has done to it makes me sad i but i suppose i there are other things that are similar to that like um i'm sure there are some people that feel the same way about the way you the way you were raised or whatever um i i do think like there was one um girl that got popular on twitter cuz that's where i go um and she was like no one cares about um uh if i'm conservative and goth or not um, you're just chronically online. And it was like, no, girl, you suck. <laughs> See this kind of comes from Let's finish that sentence. Yeah. It is a bit unfortunate, but I'm not, I'm not super into those. Uh, I'm not in those circles, so I can't, I'm not super familiar and shan't speak on it um but i definitely see what you're saying um <laughs> like all the fucking conservatives being like uh green day is woke <laughs> or whatever they're saying now i love when they get butthurt over stupid shit like that it's my favorite that make me laugh. <laughs> yeah. And it's funny because they've, they've always been chill. 
they were on Phineas and Ferb. They had to be chill. They had to be, you know, rocking with it at least a little bit. It's on the Ugh. Yuck. Get the fuck out of here. You're nasty. You're sick. Can't even imagine. Ugh. Die. Faster, because you're probably like 8,000 years old. Okay, I'm definitely taking this sandwich shit too seriously. So it's going to take me eight bajillion years. So don't worry about it. I don't think the um the plan I have for today is going to take a super long time. So it's not a huge deal. But I am still upset um, that I am like this. <sighs> ben just seems about serious. <laughs> I love the days of this. Which is so... Ugh. But, like, I feel like a lot of the conservative movement definitely, like, um, doesn't have a great understanding of, um, anything, really. So, music is certainly no exception, I would say. So, I can't say I'm particularly surprised that th these things happen, you know what I mean? <laughs> no, they hate art. They uh, truffle is really annoying. Hold on, give me two seconds. The window isn't open. Do you still want in? You can, but there's nothing fun. In or out? Yeah, that's what I thought. You will pick up food. Thank you. You ever seen Christian movies? Dude, I fucking love Christian movies. They're so funny. I am a um I'm a Hallmark movie defender and they all have like the aftertaste of um Christianity cuz they're all they all end well like everyone is nice and like pure and they don't kiss until like the tail end or whatever if they kiss at all I don't even remember hi truffle are you fucking annoying I love you um I I watched a guy since I don't watch movies I watch other people watch movies for me um I've been listening to Christian movie fans to New Fred Extremity. Never heard of it, but I'm sure that will go well. I'm almost certain. Um. Good at your life. Good at your mind. Die of your hair. Um. I watched some guy watch, like, bits and pieces of God's Not Dead, which is a movie that was, like, I think really popular when I was a kid. So I kept seeing it, like, around places, but I had never seen it myself because I was, like, a little guy. Um, But I had watched some guy watch it, and oh my god, it, I didn't know that that movie was like that. You know what I mean? Because <laughs> I don't know who that is. Um, hi, Travolta. Hold on. Let me Google him. Let me Google both of those guys. Was he like an actor in it? Or did he? Hold on. Your mind, dying of your hair. What truffle? I'm learning about Kevin Sorbo, the ugliest man on earth. <laughs> Oh my god, please shave. You're so nasty. Ugh. Oh my god, is, was he the um the atheist in the movie? Oh god, he's annoying. What the hell? <laughs> Some of these other movies are nasty. I can't breathe. God forgive them. The girl who believes in miracles. Faith under fire, one nation under God. Miracle in East Texas. 
oh god he hasn't recovered this sort used to be hercules cool i did see that but i'm noticing other worser things for sure bernie the dolphin too sorry um he was okay that's what i thought it, i it's been a minute since i've seen the video um his most recent movie and god made man do it with me do Okay, hold on. Dean Cain. Oh my god, I think I have. I haven't, like... I'm not super, like, intimately familiar, but I think I've heard of it before. H-O-T-T-O-G-O You can take me off the go Oh my god, and he's in God Made Man 2. Happy for him. Dean Dan. Hank's Christmas Wish. Damn off minute. Radar, The Adventures of, Bio of the Bionic Dog. Miracle at Manchester. Forgiving God. Paul's Promise doesn't have anything Christian in the name, but I'm getting some vibes there. I watched some skeptic channels. Dude, the, when I was in my Reddit atheist era, that was what I did. That's probably where I'm getting all this God's Not Dead stuff, to be honest. I don't I don't remember who I watched, watched the movie, but I, I know it was some Reddit atheist shit that I was on, um, like fresh out of high school. Um, I love watching people like do movie commentary. But it's it's extra fun when it's like like right wing like stupid dumbass shit. Um, I'm hard to go. I love to go. Y'all struggle? Do you wanna sit? Oh shit! Her ass does not want to sit. <sighs> um, another one of my personal favorites was watching people um like go through um oh she's stupid um was watching people go through uh girl defined videos and like that other couple who the fuck were i don't remember their names but it was a a woman and a man they were married fuck i don't remember their name i don't remember their youtube like channel either Morgan, I think, was one of them. What, Truffle? Do you want to sit? Do you want to sit this time? Come here. Come sit. Come sit. No, you're, you're stupid? Okay, that's fine. I wish I could remember their name because they were, oh my god, especially weird. Um, Rick? There's no shot that is fucking Rick. <laughs> Um, but it was a funny thought to have, I think. Um. Um. There was one. There was one video that they had done that was, um. Servo's, like, low-key king of cringe. He turned up to a concert event in a suit that had an line with his own tweets lining. That's so stupid. Truffle, are you done? Are you done being in here? Or do you want to stay? Because you can stay. You, you done? I can't tell. Do you want to be done? Sorry. You're so stupid. <clears throat> Excuse poor English. Moving has probably went. Oh yeah, congrats on moving. Happy move. How's the house treating you? Hopefully good. Um, I 
as well, thanks. Gremlins, this is supposed to be removed. LMAO. I have 11 bug bites on my shoulder. I counted. That is a disgusting amount. To be frank. Anyway, well, I'm glad moving has been going well. Happy gremlin as well. Um. I'd love for this to go faster. It will not. I ended up, <laughs> so this morning, I, I don't have a real job, but I, I open my email every day just in case, just in case something comes up, right? And so I had checked my email and the fur I had an email, um, which was weird. Um, figured he knew what moving was because he got a bit distressed when we were packing. We think his prior... Oh no, that's so sad and fucked up. I hate when that happens. I'm not immune to sad animal story on ASPCA commercial. Or Bolt. That's what they did in Bolt to the cat. Love her. God, that's so fucked up. Well, I'm glad. <laughs> I'm glad you took him and hopefully healed his trauma a little bit at least. Um probably doesn't need to be that right, but don't worry about it. Um anyway, so I had checked my email this morning and um I had um Um, I got an email from my boss's boss, which isn't like, it, it was, it was a little weird because I don't talk to this guy because he works at the other campus, which means he's like way out. Um, he'd been like way, way more affectionate with us when we were packing and refused to like leave the house to go out in the garden. I spent... To get him a leash and roomy cat carrier. Put one on. Aww. Kitty. That's so sad. Truffle has abandonment issues. She hasn't been with anybody else but us. But she fucking hates when we leave. Um... Like, she freaks the fuck out. Like, the last time we went on vacation, I think in, like, November or some shit, right? And she, um, the people we had, like, asked to watch her or whatever, um, had come back, had come to check on her. And it was, like, the house was covered in, in throw up and shit everywhere because it had been... A couple of days since we left. And it's... She hasn't... She was born in, like, a barn or whatever. And then given to us, like, six weeks out. Like, whatever the cat... The safe kitten age is for them to be away from their mom or whatever. That was when we got her. So she hasn't been through anything traumatizing. She's just fucking annoying. Hi. Okay, I've had enough reggae, thank you. No, thank you. That's good. Um. But yeah, love her so much. I'm sorry she gets sad. But like, oh my god, dude. You haven't had anything happen to you. Please be normal. We're talking about Truffle. And how annoying she is. And Floss's cat. Put your hands in your pockets and look the other way. 
She's a chill man. Yeah. Love her. Cause it never happens, politely and smile as you turn around. And do the act like you never met me. Do the act like you never met me. Never met me. I love taking way too much time and working on the warm ups for eight bajillion years. It's literally my favorite activity. Clearly minded, no, I always like the way you dance. Simpler the ones you did before. Just point out your tongue and someone will know. Pretend that you don't. Ooh. It's way too dark. Still way too dark. That's better. Maybe you got like a. Okay, slay. I'm trying not to color pick. I feel like that should help me understand color a little better. It's not color picking, but I'm. It's there for a reason. You know what I mean. But color is what I'm trying to work on. I redid my journal or whatever earlier. Um, trying to figure out how best to draw consistently. Because that's um, what I've been struggling with. Is like drawing um, often. Um, and so... I decided that I wouldn't, um, take for a couple more, um, I wouldn't try and stress so much about getting, um, like, full pieces done, um, like every single day and I would try to do studies or whatever because I um the other day when we were talking or whatever and I was like hmm so to learn you can draw things you're familiar with and use it to learn just one thing at a time I really uh I really thought there um crazy good thought that I had um, but I am also stupid. Sorry, Michael, I'm really not feeling it right now. Thank you. Um, so I finally got around to, um, like, um, Um, like, writing down specifically what I wanted to do. Um, and, like, making sure that I had, like, a good plan for what I was going to draw this week. Um, because that's another thing is, like, having a good idea of what I'm going to draw. Um, before I go and do it. Um, is pretty critical. Um, because if I don't have a good idea, I don't learn anything, first of all. Because I, like, the past couple warm-ups or whatever that we've done, I was not, um, doing anything new. 
I'm hoping that someday please stop. Who do that? Maybe make this even darker. Um X Um Cause like doing sketches is nothing. For me at least. Like I I, I don't I don't learn anything. Looking at a picture and sketching. I have done that for years. That's not something that needs to be improved upon. Um, there is Miami. You still got me in the mood. Um, girl, with you. Hey, that's the wrong color. With the wrong girl. I know you're my ex, but I still want to have sex with you. My ex, but I still want to have sex with you. See the girls in Cali. See the girls in New York, London, Paris, Miami. You still got me in the mood. And then there's like a... Kind of like a mid-tone red in between these two maybe a little darker maybe a little more saturated that's good there may be hope for us yet to get to what i was actually supposed to be doing today um i feel like this isn't saturated enough I almost feel like I forget that adding color variation to it helps. My bad. Like if this were slightly orange, perhaps. She wants to give it all, oh, she wants to give it, she wants to give it all, oh, she wants to give it, she wants to give it all, oh, she wants to give it. She wants to give it. I... I email my mom. Right. I don't got a real job. I have nothing better to do. So I'm like, hey, mom, good morning. How are you? And we talk. And so I think the other day I was bitching about not having enough cash. Blah, blah, blah. You know, classic poor people shit. Um, <laughs> and I love to email people. I was born to email because it's not on my phone. I am not a texter. It was just funny because I text, but not in the way you think. I've 
I've just recently noticed. Sorry, I'm going to put my hand back on the pen and continue drawing. Um, don't let me do that shit. I I start talking with my hands, and you can see that I'm not drawing anymore. Very funny. Don't let me do that. Catch me. Um, tell me to stop. Um, anyway, so the um, she wants to give it. Um, she uh, what the fuck was I saying? I got distracted. Um, point is, is that I email people. Oh yeah, I was to text. Okay, I text right, and so um, I um. I'll text people or whatever, but it'll be on my computer. I've just recently noticed how little I'm on my phone until I downloaded the Bumble for Friends app or whatever, and then I had to text with my hands in a, in a, in a, on a phone with my, I mean, you always type with hands. I don't know why I said that. Sorry. Anyway, <laughs> I, I, it, it, I never noticed that I always, I'm always typing on a keyboard, because that's what I prefer. Um, it's faster, superior in every way, um, tactile, if you will, if, if you're mentally ill. Um, I, and, and I know I am, so tactile. Um, I just prefer it. It's better to type on a keyboard. And so, anyway, I was born to email, because of that, like, typically when you're emailing people, it is on a keyboard, on a real computer, and it's fucking awesome, no notes. I don't like the act of emailing in the sense that, like, it's kind of icky, because, like, people don't... I don't know that there's a, like a weird culture with it that I'm not super in tune with at this stage. Um, I'm a pretty friendly emailer. I'm like, here's this thing you asked for explanation point, happy face. You know what I mean? Like I don't take this emailing shit too seriously, especially considering I don't email um, anybody who's like important to my job. So it's even worse as a result. But anyway, point is, Good God, um, I was emailing my mom the other day, and, um, she was, I was bitching about, um, not having enough money, and I was like, I don't think I have enough time for, like, a side hustle, or whatever, um, and so we had been in, in talks, um, about her crochet business, or whatever, and, um, the fact that I should make her stickers. And now, this is all fine. I, I wouldn't mind doing stickers or whatever. Um, it's kind of, who gives a shit? Um, I'll do the stickers. Um, but now, but she's got, like, a deadline. <laughs> <laughs> I don't fucking feel, I don't feel like drawing these stickers, man. Mainly because I don't exactly have all the resources I need. That's half of it. Because, like, technically I could do them, like, right fucking now without any problem. Um, stickers are fun. And so she wants to do stickers of, like, her, like, most popular selling things. Or whatever, and she's like, yeah, we can put them up on Etsy, and people could buy them off of Etsy. And I was like, yeah, I guess so. I, But I'm just not a super big sticker purchaser, so I just don't see anyone buying them because I don't buy them. I, And that's kind of... That's not how business works, but it, that's... How I think of things is like, if I wouldn't buy it, why would I sell it? That kind of thing. Um, that just feels logical to me. Um, you're ridiculous. Met white, but okay. I mean, 
I'm not saying nobody's gonna buy stickers. Bitches love stickers. My mom. Um, <laughs> she fucking loves stickers. I just don't care for stickers, so I can't like. And I, you are also bitches. Um, you love stickers. Mom gave me another sticker, and there's no room for it on my laptop, so that's just not going nowhere. Um, unfortunately for that sticker. Um, uh, um, 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 but yeah, so now she's got, like, a deadline or whatever for these stickers. <laughs> um, and I didn't get anything done of my own today. I added it to my list of stuff to work on. Um, I would, thank you, thank you. Um. I still wish you the best. Um. Okay, let's be honest for a second. Um. Oh my god. Okay, forget the stickers. I'm done talking about it. We're moving on. I I went to um work or whatever and the construction is horrific, right? Um my day overall was pretty horrific, but I had a most magnificent drive in to work today. It wasn't super stressful. It was pretty average. I was like, "Hell yeah, brother." Um super excited that nothing a uh, a miss occurred and then I went home and so the no thank you Hall and Oates I gotta go that's good um I had uh um sorry about your day thank you cat um no big we've I was gonna say we've moved on my ass has not moved on <laughs> But we will eventually. Hey, hi, guy. How are you? Hope you're good. You said nothing about it. Take your ass back home. You really not ain't the biggest my phone. Slide with your boy to the bar. Slide with your boy to the car. Chunky. No, not your chicken. Well, I hope you have a bit of fun, at least. Um, but anyway, so I decided to take a slightly different way out of the building today, um, of the parking garage, because you can, so out of the parking garage, you can either turn left or right, and so typically I turn right to get onto the road that I'm on for, like, two seconds. Hang on the Hi, BF. Hi. Hope he's good. Hope you're good also. Right. Party, take your ass back home. You ain't it naughty, baby. Here's my phone. But anyway, the, um, there's a, uh, beams it in your brain. Detour. That goes under the road that I'm typically trying to get on. To get onto the main road. Um. That I use to take. To get home. And so. I had. It's pretty much always backed up now. And so there's no shot. That in a timely fashion. I am going to be able to. Um. Get on to that road because no one like because everyone being in traffic doesn't like to let other people over. I get it. I hear you. I understand. To I'm with you. I'm on board. Um, 
that doesn't, but when I am the one who needs to get in, I'm a little less forgiving about it. Um, so instead of putting myself through that hell, I, um, turned left because I, um, we went home, so we went to that baseball game. Um, we won pretty handily. We left the seventh, eighth inning or some shit. Um, yeah, we, we fucking slaughtered them. They th- should have been a we didn't quite hit, hit, kill them that hard, but the other team, I swear to my chicken, I believe you, um, but the, um, our team had, uh, no, I'm sorry, the other team, w- like, kind of quit and, like, put in their worst fucking pitcher of all time, and, like, there were so many problems. Like, he kept almost hitting people with the ball. Um, it was pretty nasty for, like, a, that um half inning um that he was pitching it was so fucking funny though um glad they got to let him play ball um or whatever like what is he doing here (laughs) but whatever so anyway i turned down the other way and driving didn't fucking suck and it was fucking awesome because i was a little scared that as a result of um me going down there there was a shot that um everyone would be taking that road to get um to the to where I needed to go and so it was going to be backed up it wasn't so I'm basically I'm going to do that every day now so basically driving has been fixed um I am no longer um a driving hater I am a driving tolerator so jot that down this huge day for me. Very successful drive. I just thought I'd ask. So I turned back the time. I'm at the shadow and I feel. Thank you, Kat. I appreciate it. Alternatively, um, and normally it's the other way around. We're like driving really fucking sucks shit. And it makes me want to kill myself. And then like when I get to work, it's like fine. Um, it was actually the opposite day where driving went great. Um, and then I got to work and it was like, oh, okay, life is not worth living because my boss c- is quitting. And I had to find out through an email from her boss, but she like, and it, but it was like sent last week. Um, it was like an hour after I had left on Thursday last week. So I, um, had, uh, I, I was confused by this email. So I was like, um, so I go up to my boss and I'm like, Hey, so what the fuck does this mean? Um, cause so the email was like, Hey, um, what is your schedule, uh, for the summer and the rest of summer and, um, fall. And I was like, and, and then it was like, blah, 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 blah. We don't know what you're gonna what we're gonna do with your boss's position yet. And I was like, huh? You don't fucking what? Cause it made it sound like she was quitting. And I had no idea. So I was like, um, I'm gonna go ask her about this, I guess, because she's sitting right there. So I go up to her, I'm like, so I got an email from your boss, and um it sounds like you're quitting. Is that fucking true? What's your issue, man? And so she was just like, oh, I'm so sorry. I was, um, I, I was going to tell you, but I needed to tell Mark first. And I was like, um, okay, but like, did you have to? Um, I didn't say that, obviously, because I'm super polite and respectful. Um, but yeah, she just like didn't tell me. And then like Mark dropped it on me pretty badly and I'm not a super huge fan of change. Um, so I was basically freaking out about it all day because they don't know if, if they're going to replace her position or not. And so if they don't replace her position, they, um, 
um, they're going to hire a second version of me, which means I'm going to have to train this motherfucker. Um, not that the job is hard or anything, but like, holy fuck, the fact that I'm going to be the one with that responsibility really blows because the librarian, you know, the guy with the degree, um, for librarianing, he has like a different job than, than me and, uh, my boss. Because she does, like, circulation work, which is apparently different to um, the whatever the fuck he does, which is, like, research shit. Um, deeply upsetting that this is occurring to me. Um, and, like, there's... I could, I guess... I asked to take her job, but I'm also starting classes back up next, um, next fall or whatever. Not next fall. This coming up fall. This fall. Um, so I'd have to, like, tell them, just kidding, I'm not going to class anymore because her job is a full-time job. But if they did let me do that shit... Maybe some shit would get done around here. Holy fuck. Because nothing ever gets done. I'm going to kill myself. Anyway. <laughs> it's a... It's all painfully real. Shall I say. Overall, it's not a huge deal. I'm just tired. Okay, maybe it is a big deal. I don't know. I don't like change and it's freaking me out. And she kept, it was funny because we talked for a while and we don't talk typically. Um, and so she was like, um, yeah, just like, if you need to get out of here, do that. And I was like, do I need to get out of here? <laughs> like, like, you're really making it sound like everything is going to crash and burn as soon as you're gone. And it, she's also like implying that I have some kind of like loyalty to this job. No, man. I have loyalty to how flexible it is. I don't have to fucking do anything. It is not a real job. Which is frustrating sometimes. And then other times it's like, oh, wow, this is the greatest thing to ever happen to me. I'm really... I've... But she's so fucked up. Because I've been doing... Because my... um The librarian guy. Um. He... Um... <laughs> he uh 